Welcome to my so-called life, season two. My name is William, and this is the House of Sewing. My so-called life is sponsored by... Welcome to my so-called life. You know, I hope everyone is doing well. I've had an awesome week. This week, I made quite a few things, but I'm going to stick to my cheetah trench coat because last week, I set out to do something, and I did. Somewhere along the line, I also made a cheetah shirt, and they look amazing together. Also, I have finally found a Singer heavy duty gray sewing machine for a reasonable price. I've been waffling for a while on how I want one, but I refuse to pay full price and it finally paid off. Well, my adventures in thrifting finally paid off. <laughs> so this is going to be awesome. So as always, let's go sewing. They're just touching Touchtronic memory machines. Incredible. I'm Polly Bergen. Only Singer makes machines this easy to use. Touch. The memory remembers your stitch pattern instantly. Touchtronic speed control remembers to adjust your fabric thickness. What about basting? Touch. Great. You can forget about your sewing machine and concentrate on sewing. The Touchtronic memory machine family. Come take a test touch. So, I know what some of you are saying. I've seen a ton of videos of people saying, buyer beware, stay away from the Singer Heavy Duty. But in a weird way, this machine is something that I've been looking for. I collect sewing machines, but more than anything else, I have Singer sewing machines. I have Singer sewing machines going back over 120 years plus. The funny thing is, is this is just something that I was looking for, something that I wanted. I've been using it here and there, and it is everything that everybody says that it is. But it's a semi-reliable machine. I think what happened is that the person who had this machine previously used it for a specific project and then never used it again. I plugged it in. I oiled it a little bit. I took care of a few problems. But after about a week, this is like a brand new sewing machine. So, like I always say, instead of talking about it, let's go check it out. So, after all the hype, this is the moment of truth. <laughs> I've had this machine for a couple of days. I've been using it. There's been some ups and downs, but it's a pretty solid machine. And that sounds perfect. <laughs> Like I said, all I did was clean this machine up. I think it was used for one or two projects and someone just sent it off to the Goodwill. Yasafue style. But here it is. <laughs> An almost brand new Singer Heavy Duty. Laid down the perfect stitch as well. My lighting's all over the place, but this threw down the perfect stitch. And like I always say, that's all that matters. People are label snobs and they'll say, I use this machine, this is better than that. So far, this Singer Heavy Duty is everything I thought it would be. <laughs> and I want to chalk it up as a win. So welcome to the fleet and like i always say stay creative keep sewing so i decided to go a little bit longer on the trench coat and i love the way it came out the shirt came out 
perfect as well i had a little bit of issues with the head hole but sometimes i miscalculate the size of my head and i know i cannot be the only person that does that <laughs> but all in all this came out perfect i love the 1970s giant collar the print everything is beautiful i'm laughing because a year or two ago i i said you know what i'm gonna add color to my wardrobe and here i am <laughs> This is a beautiful combination. You know, I used good old Mimi G pattern R11407, but I have done a ton of variations and I've kind of perfected my own coat using that pattern. But again, I love how this came out. So this was perfect for Friday sales because last week I said I was gonna do something and here I am. So, like I always say, stay creative, keep sewing. Do you know what's funny? I purchased this vest in October and I am still in love with this. <laughs> I've been wearing this and it makes me laugh because I can tell every single person's age when they're like, I love your vest. I know how old you are and I see you. <laughs> So, I have plans for next week. I'm going to kind of go outside the box because I'm not a bag maker. But I've had this McCall's pattern for a while. And I figure I'm going to give it a go. It's McCall's L9467 bags. It's pretty straightforward, but I'm going to give it a try. I might make both, but I think it's definitely time to switch it up a little bit and i need a bag or something that i can carry downtown when i'm going from shop to shop so i'm gonna give this a try So I've been going downtown for about two or three months now. It feels like so much longer because I have purchased miles of fabric. So on one of my last trips, I purchased this fake Fendi material. I've been looking for a while for some awesome fake Fendi prints and I was not disappointed. Downtown Los Angeles is known for bootleg material, but it, that whole industry has kind of disappeared and I'm here for the dregs of it. I had to go dig through a pile to find this and like I always say, I was not disappointed. This is exactly what I was looking for. You can tell it's a knockoff, but it also looks like a Fendi coat. I lined it with a plaid material that I had intentions of making another kilt out of, but I have enough that if I really wanted to, I can go back and still make the kilt. But the combination of the blue and the black and the plaid is perfect. I still haven't added a collar or a hood yet. I'm probably going to do both, but I love how this project is coming out and I'm going to continue sewing on it and perfecting my fake Fendi coat. So like I always say, stay creative, keep sewing. So it is definitely that time of year this is my walk-in closet and it's a mess well it was a walk-in closet it just became another storage unit so this is going to be my attempt at cleaning out my walk-in closet and bringing it back to its glory so instead of talking about it let's get cleaning Get the most fun out of life Out 
proud of being a mother and wife With new fashion excitement that's all created by you On your new Touch and Sew so. Sewing machine by Singer Touch and Sew so. Another first from Singer Be the girl with the golden touch On your new Singer Golden Touch and Sew machine Dozens of exclusive features Like this new built-in needle threader For the golden slant needle And the push-button bobbin that winds right in the machine What a wonderful new feeling You can do all three kinds of sewing Straight, zigzag, and chain stitch Touch and sew the push button bobbin way. Come sew on one at your Singer Center. Choose from five touch and sew models from $149.95. What's new for tomorrow is at Singer today. So, needless to say, my closet is still a work in progress. But if you can see the chair, that's a victory. I've cleared the room out. I've really organized and I've found quite a few things that I've been looking for. And I've also added to a few mysteries here in the house of sewing. But I'll save it for next week. If you've made it this far, I thank you. And like I always say, reinforce your seams, be yourself, and I will definitely, definitely see you next time.